the ride takes to take to go to my um, aunt's house. Just follow the new Taipei City Hall fellow. And we're there in about, I would say like maybe five, ten minutes. It's very, very fast. Like, no one's walking the yellow line. No one's walking the yellow line, too. It's pretty easy to get to my auntie's house from here. I mean, I'm sorry, but can I ask you something? And then you can ask him like, Or if you want to say, I want to go on this. Blue line. Well, that's, that's it. So, I'm going to walk up these steps. A lot of steps here. I want to walk up these steps again. New type of safe Oh, new type of safe It's pretty easy. And this is a. Is this like waterfall? Like, I don't know what it is. Waterfall garden? Look at the plant. There's this big cone like thing. I don't even know what that is. I'm go restroom. It's right there. Oh, oh, Every day I'm walking at least like, I don't know how many steps, but it's really intense walking. I'm gonna say it's not raining. Steps. I'm pretty much almost there. Mm. This is Xing Taipei City Hall. Xing means new, Taipei is Taipei City Hall. It's like really tall. Over there is the train station. Bus station's over there on that side. Train station, subway system all goes through here. Oh, it's a really long walk. Ugh. I'm not tired, but I think I might take off one of my jackets. Or yeah, I'll probably take off my cardigan because it's super hot. Well, it's not hot, it's just like when I climb those stairs, I get super winded. I used to climb sunny stairs in America. Most everything's flat, so it's all like, woo woo. I'm going to come to Taiwan. Oh. We'll have to climb a lot of stairs. And my, my auntie's house, oh, she lives on the fifth floor, so it's the highest, like, so basically my auntie lives on the fifth floor, so it's the highest, uh, the highest, like, building. Well, it's not high, but actually okay, but I think it'd take at least, like, I don't know, like 50, that's where get upstairs. This is Xing Tai Xing Tai Pei. I don't know. So you call. There's like some of the read. Cool. They'll tell you exactly where to go. You are confused or whatever. Follow direction. See team to lobby the information. Popo. There's police everywhere. There's popo everywhere. This depends on when you see them. You go. If you need help or anything. Or somebody just ask the police. Well, yeah, but I also got my, um, for those of you guys who don't know, I also got my white, my SIM, SIM card actually changed out yesterday night. My Jojo, my uncle, actually helped me get that done. So that was cool. Thanks, Jojo. This door is kind of slow. There's a lot of places to be in Taiwan. So many places. There's two easy house. And then I just walked down this crossway right here. And down a little ways to my, uh, my auntie's house. Not far at all. The other day we went down over there. 
like all the way down over there, like way farther than I'm pointing out to eat um, Fan Tuan, which is one of my favorite morning meals ever. Fan Tuan is one of the best things you can ever eat. They put Chinese donut, they also put um, zhou song, which is like, um, um, zhou song is like, it's like dried pork. They put a little bit of uh, salted radish. Chinese donut. And they wrap it up rice and so freaking good. If you guys haven't seen my previous video, definitely check it out. It's freaking amazing. It's so good. It's super crispy. It's salty. It's really good. So I'm gonna walk to my lunch house. I'm just down there that way. Um, I'll show you guys the salon where I got my hair done. Like, let's get our hair done and I was like okay so my hair is a little bit more purplish red and today I'm actually gonna wash my hair for the first time in two days and if you know me you know I wash my hair every freaking day so this will be kind of it's not gonna be weird but well, I mean it might be a little weird but I think well, I think if I wash my hair it would be okay That's Taiwanese. I really don't understand Taiwanese as well as I do Mandarin. Japang means sipa or finish, are you full? Well, every time I go back to my ima ja, she asks me, Japa! So, wo japa la. La, wo japa la. Also, and then she said, okay, okay. That means, are you full? And I'm like, yes. Because most of the time I eat, I usually, well, what happens, I usually eat dinner at my auntie's house, which we're going to go to right now. And I like eating dinner at her house because she makes freaking amazing food. Like, her shrimp and egg is so good. It's like almost like, I mean, I'm going to say it's better than restaurant style in America. Restaurant style is okay. But I still think my, my auntie makes the best shrimp and egg ever. Like, way better than my mom, way better than the restaurant style in America. So we're going to walk soon. So there you can see, but there's a little stop guy right there. Stop, don't go. I'm gonna turn the screen, I'll show you guys what. And then it has a timer, which is actually really convenient for those of you that there were like, oh no, to cross the street. And you want to make sure if it crosses the street, you see these white lines. See now, it's right here. So see now, it's slowly moving up. 7, 36, 35. That's how you tell how to walk. See the little green guy walking as well. So you guys will know, if you guys ever come to Taiwan, how to walk. You want to make sure you're walking like that. You don't want to ever walk on like that side because. If you do walk on that side, you might get a little bit, you might get run over or something. So make sure if you see the white lines. Well, sometimes you can actually cross the street without the white lines, but you have to be very careful. No one runs you over. So basically, you can see, but. Miko Hair Salon was where me and my cousin actually got our hair done. Much is right across the street from there, like right there. So let's just go, go see my auntie. To this. Hold on, let me show you guys. It's like right across there from Miko. Miko's right there. Let me show you guys a little closer. I don't know if you guys can see this. Miko is right here. And this right here. This red door. For her. This is where my auntie lives. Miko is right there. The right across, well, not directly across, but you know, pretty close. Right now. Hey, Ming Yao. Oh. Yeah, they have these intercoms where you're supposed to talk to them. I guess it's pretty smart. I don't want to take my parting it off because it feels super hot, which. Yeah, this is my cousin's scooter. She doesn't really ride it. Let me just take my check out because it's super hot.
under $10, about $9.16 to get my hair washed and me to get a bath massage and for her to curl my hair like this, which is actually really, really cheap. In the US, if you were to do that, you probably have to get your hair dyed and you probably have to like, or either our hair cut. If you have really, really long hair, they usually wash your hair. I don't know if you can get bath massages in America, but it was so good. It was like, oh my god, it was so good. So I'm going back to my auntie's house. So my aunt's house is right over there. I'm just gonna walk over there right now where it says easy. It's raining a little bit, it's drizzling a little bit, but it's okay. I'm gonna walk over there. See you guys later.